Je ne t'ai rien et voilà qu'aujourd'hui Je suis le gardien du sommeil de ce nuit et je l'aime à mourir Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I am doing a video which is 10 names we love but <clears throat> 10 names we love but won't be using. Some of these names, most of the names are names that I love but we won't be using either because we have a lot of other options. Um, what I mean by using is for the next child, if we have an, another child. Um, and so the I have five girls names and five boy names. So Chris has known what name he would name his daughter or son since high school. So I picked the middle name, um, which I will not announce the name until our son is born. Then I will make a video about it much later. So have until sometime in January. Um, so names. Um, the first name is I have is Isabel. I really always liked this since high school, but the thing is we live in Haiti and I can't really see them saying Isabel, like, yeah, there is an, you can say it, it's Isabel, but it's, I don't know. I just, I guess I outgrew that name. <laughs> so that's the first one. And then Lloyd. Um, so Chris, it was either Lloyd or the name we have. Um, but I don't want our son to be named Lloyd just because Chris's father is named Lloyd and Chris's middle name is Lloyd. I don't want three Lloyds in the family. Like that's just a lot of Lloyds. <laughs> um, and also it's, since I am Jewish, it is in tradition, you can name someone after a family member if they have passed away. Um, our second girl name is Anais, which it's pretty and it's not that common, but I don't know. Um, yeah, our second boy name is Gaspar, um, which is super French. Uh, but this is very French. C'est très très français. Um, the other one is Tova. I did pick a lot of a few Jewish names since I am Jewish and I wanted that incorporated into my son's name. You know, for me, Jewish is not really that much about the religion, but more culturally and more our ancestors and my grandmother. I was named after my grandmother. Um, so the name is Tova, um, which is very Jewish. <laughs> it's just, I think it's a little too Jewish. Um, the third name would be Jules, um, which I always liked because of the film, uh, Francois Truffaut's film, uh, Jules and Jim. Um, but I'm... I don't really, I don't really see that, especially in Haiti, Jules, Jules, is this, uh, I don't know, it's just clunky, I feel. Uh, my fourth girl's name is Maya. I feel like this, that name has been very common and I didn't want a very common name. Um, I have no idea what our if we have a daughter next time, what her name will be. Because Chris is very secretive about it. He did not tell me what our son's, the two choices of our son's name was until, I feel like I was like 25 weeks pregnant. <laughs> uh, something ridiculous like that. Like I, eventually I stopped asking him and then he finally told me on his own. Um, the next name is Theo, um, which is fine. It, I mean, all of these names, I love, I love these names. It's just, I don't see us using it because we have so many other choices of names that we do love and that we do, I think could be either middle name or first name. Um, it just depends. And then um for the the last girl's name i have is zora z-o-r-a um it's also a jewish name like three of these names are jewish just isabel and anais is not jewish um 
I do have a lot of Jewish names that I still, for boys, that I still love and still might consider, even if it's a middle name. Then there is Bo. Um, that's the last one. I just know a lot of Bo's recently, so I feel like that name is becoming more common and I don't exactly want a very common name. Um, so those are the names that I have. Um, I mean, you know, all these names are beautiful names. I don't think you can go, go wrong with these names. It's just, I don't think that they are what we would use because a name means something. And also thinking about the fact that I'm going to say this name for the rest of my life, especially when I'm a teenager, I'm sure I'm going to be yelling that name. So I need to really love, love that name and be able to say that name for the rest of my life, every single day of my life. And these names, I don't see myself saying these every single day of my life. I do really like the name that we chose. Um, I think it's a strong name and it's a beautiful name. And the, the, na the middle name is Jewish and I really love the name that I chose. It's a good name. Um, and I'm really excited to announce it when the baby is born. Uh, so thank you so much for watching. Please like this video, please subscribe, and please press the notification button so that way you will always be notified whenever I post a new video. Thanks. Bye.